The workouts have been going really good. I've been staying on track three weeks straight. Uh, today was a bodybuilding day. was super looking forward to it. Bodybuilding is one of those workouts where you really get to see your progress because you get to have a pump and that's when the leanness really shows through. And after three weeks, I can clearly tell that my physique has changed already, so I'm really motivated and excited. Uh, one of the things that I noticed that I've changed already is um, I'm starting to have more shoulder and tricep separation, as well as shoulders and bicep separation. So before it was just like this one big old lump, but now it's starting to form like its own muscle groups. And then my love handles are starting to shrink. There were huge muffin tops before, but now like when I jump around, it just jiggles just a little bit. It's still there of course, but it's, it's starting to get reduced and shaped down. And then my abs are starting to come through a lot more. And I can tell on my face too. So I could see a lot of changes. Before we start any of the fun stuff, we're gonna start off with some speed bench with 225 and super sledded with sled. And fuck man, anytime you throw sled in the mix, you know it's gonna get your heart rate up. But that's exactly what we need to get ourselves in the right mindset. I'm really excited for this workout because bodybuilding is hella fun. And it's a nice break from powerlifting. So I can't wait to get a pump. I'm so tired right now. It doesn't hurt during the sprint. It hurts immediately right after for some reason. The first couple weeks of any program are gonna be the hardest because it's kind of like a hell week, you know? Like you're shocking your body, your body's not used to it, you have to get your mind right, and you have to adopt your entire lifestyle. But if you can get past the first couple of weeks, it becomes easier, your body becomes acclimated to the workout. And this is the end of my third week and it feels really, really good. I'm really excited to take on the next couple of weeks of the program, but it does get harder, so I do have to watch out there. Today we're running the rack for curls on dumbbells because on bodybuilding days, I like to have fun and switch it up. When you're powerlifting, like you have very specific reps and sets and you got specific numbers and percentages. And so it's so structured that on bodybuilding days, I think it's fun to just try brand new exercises. And running the rack was something that I always did in high school. Like all the bros would just grab all the weights and just go all the way down. And I remember getting a crazy pump there. So I was like, fuck it, today is bodybuilding day. Let's get a crazy pump on the biceps. Behind taking your body to space and beyond. <laughs> Have you ever been to Mars? <laughs> well, I'll take you there, bud. Well, my biceps have. <laughs> Pick it, bro. Pick it. I got a crazy ass pump afterwards. My bicep felt like it was gonna explode. Like, even when I was trying to flex to see how much progress I've made, I felt like I was gonna cramp up any second. I'm 210 right now. In about four weeks, theoretically, I should be around 206. But um, as you start losing weight, your body starts to hold on to the weight more. You're gonna start plateauing. So I would say realistically, probably around 207. But if I can squeeze in the additional cardio, I can probably stay on track and be around 206, 205. You know, it's just way easier if you have someone cutting with you and you guys do it together. But if you don't have a buddy to cut with you, I think it's awesome to find your favorite fitness athlete. David Soul's cutting right now. Silent Mike is cutting right now. There's a lot of people that are trying to get lean and get in the best shape of their life. So if you could follow them along their journey, it helps make your journey that much easier. And even for me, like when I don't have my training partners around, the people that keep me accountable are you guys. Cause I wanna show you guys that it can be done. I can be the strongest and leanest I've ever been. And I don't wanna let you guys down either.